Hey there, it's Big Tony over here at Natchi coming at you with the test server this weekend. And uh, it's going to be an interesting update, I think, guys. Uh, I played that uh, test server this weekend and uh, won the Ocho. On paper, its nerf doesn't look too horribly bad. In reality, it's pretty brutal. Uh, you take a, a, yes, in Rampage mode or Stampede mode, you go from a 60, 40, 20, uh, you know, split as far as your damage goes in Stampede, to now a 20, 30, 40. What I don't, what I think there also is, is there is also a passive, a passive resistance to DOT uh, reduction as well. And it's not put in there. Let's see if we get this guy out of here. Um, basically, this thing gets beat up really quick on test server. Uh, with pilot skills, maybe it stands up a little better on live server, but I think the, uh, the you know the general idea is this thing is uh, it's seen its better day, and now I think we're definitely going to see some uh, we're going to see some changes to it. Um, I've been the thing gets wiped out pretty quick. I mean, I play aggressive just like I do on the regular server, and it is brutal. Uh, Ocho's days are numbered. Okay, let's go ahead and get the Shen Lu out here with the uh, electric weapons. And guys, this might be the most broken meta that this game has seen well, since the Ocho. Uh, this thing here destroys, I mean, absolutely everything. And you can teleport, and the best thing about the teleport is like, you know, you can go after a single target. Once he turns to get on you, you teleport behind him again. And you just kind of zip, zip, zip. And then at the very end, you can teleport back to your base, your base spawn point. Uh, guys. This is going to be brutal. Um, this is going to make, I'm sorry, th this is going to make the scorpion look like child's play. I mean, seriously. And this has the firepower of a Fenrir. I mean, seriously, I've got a godlike going here and I'm hardly even trying. This thing here just utterly destroys everything on the battlefield. Uh, it looks squishy, it looks small, it's got its little chicken legs, but don't, uh, don't misjudge it, guys. This thing is a brute, an absolute brute. It's not a brawler. This is just a tactical nightmare. That's what it is. Um, definitely, you're going to want some strategy for this, guys. Um, when this thing teleports in, you're going to want to—I mean, you're going to want to have the best drone that you can to give you some defense. You're going to want to be just—you're just, uh, just going to have to be exceedingly careful. Now, in the original test servers, this thing had a range of like 700 meters. Thank heavens, they parted it down to about 350 meters. And that has been the only saving grace about this. Otherwise, utterly, utterly chaotic. And like I said, this is probably going to be the most broken meta that we've seen. Now, we've also got the, uh, I looked at the, uh, you know, the Tamer, the Damper, and the Deceiver, and the Trickster. They all took nerfs, guys. And it's about a 30% nerf, as, as we thought. Um, I'll put some pictures up here in the corner. You can, you know, I'll put, you know, I'll put it on my community tab. You guys can see it there. Um, you guys will see that, you know, I have an MK2 level 12, was it uh, damper? And I compare it to the level 25, AKA MK3 damper here on test server. There's about a thousand points of damage difference per shot. That is huge. I mean, seriously huge. And uh, I have an MK level, I have an MK2 level 8 Deceiver, and it does 80 points more damage than a MK3 Deceiver here on the uh, <laughs> here on the test server. Though it does load up DOT unlimited, but uh, seriously, big nerfs coming, and the same kind of nerfs hit the uh, Tamer and the Trickster as well. So all those weapons that you leveled up are going to have to be played very, very differently than you have been playing them up to this point, if you've got them. Now, if you've been uh, you've been kind of smart and took the previous meta weapons, the Splinters, the Shatters, and things like that, and got them leveled up, they're going to be quite effective still, especially against the Ocho. Uh, I mean, it's everything is DOT to the Ocho. And if it, I think it feels like the Ocho got a passive damage reduction in its regular format, and it converts everything to DOT, yeah, the Ocho's days are numbered, guys. It isn't going to take much of a nerf to get rid of, to, uh, get rid of its brawler status on the battlefield. You're pretty much only going to do attacks with the Ocho 
when you're in stampede mode and you hope you don't have a bunch of DOT loaded up when that stampede wears off because uh, it's just going to chew you up and kill you in a couple seconds. That's what's going to happen. That, that stacked up DOT is just going to obliterate you once you're done with your stampede. So, Yep, we've been waiting for it. Ocho, uh, Ocho definitely on test server has been nerfed. I'm not going to say into the ground, but you definitely have to play it incredibly differently than you do in live server. Now, it'll be interesting when I see uh, the live server you know, nerfs go into action on the Ocho, and I'll see what happens with the actual, come on, uh, the, <laughs> with the actual good pilots on it. We'll see what happens. But wow, definitely big changes you can feel with the Ocho on, uh, you know, on the test server. Now, I don't, do, I don't do test server very often, but I plan on doing at least once a month. I'll be doing the last test server, usually of that month, uh, usually right before the next event, because oh my, come on, uh, that's when you're going to see the most truth in the adjustments and the nerfs and everything like that. At the very beginning of the month, it's pretty chaotic and everything's not, it's not the way it's going to be. You really can't put any stock into it, but oh my gosh, I'm just absolutely obliterating things with this. I mean, we're going to stack up at least 12, 13 kills with this, and that's on test server. Now, I have been uh, changing it up here. I've, I run each one of these with a different, you know, I ran uh, the, uh, basically the Firefly drone, whatever it is. Uh, whatever the name of it is, I forget it off the top of my head. The, uh, I, I, I won't remember it now. <laughs> I'm not great at remembering all these names. But uh, it's a lockdown drone. Now, what goes better is what I got right there, the Pascal. Works really, really good. And we got a victory. But I just wanted to do a quick video for you guys, a showcase for you guys, just how broken this meta is going to be. And as you can see, 14 kills, uh, two beacon caps, four assists, 6.2 million in damages. Most of that was done with the uh, brand new Shen Lao. So definitely, definitely broken meta coming. Alrighty guys, stay safe and healthy. Watch out for each other. I'll catch you on the battlefield.